Today, I'm going to show you why it's so important to create highlights and lowlights in your work, and we're going to do it while carving this Native American inspired leather cuff. That's coming up. Hello everyone, my name is Daniel Reese. This is Weaver Leather Supply. Today, we're going to be carving this Native American inspired leather cuff. We're going to be doing an antique silver finish on it with turquoise highlights along the edges. And the whole point of this video is to highlight, well, highlights. And why it's so important to not only create highlights, but also intentionally creating low lights in your work so that you can create some pretty dramatic effects. That's what we're going to do today. But here's the thing, this video is going to be a little bit different than a lot of the ones that we've done in the past. I've had a lot of you tell me how much you enjoy just when we turn on the project and let it roll and just watch the project develop and come to life. It's almost an ASMR style video where there's not a lot of interruptions. You're just kind of zoning in, relaxing, and watching the project come to life. So that's what we're going to do today. It's not true ASMR because we are going to have background music and that kind of stuff in there. But the whole idea is just to, you know, relax a little bit, watch a, a cool project come to life, and pick up some tips and tricks as we go along. Now, speaking of those tips and tricks, instead of me popping in and out and telling you what I'm going to do and telling you how to do it, what we're going to do is we're going to put graphics right down over here in this corner, and that's where the instructions are going to pop up. That way I don't have to interrupt the flow. But with that said, we can jump in. Before we can get into the meat of the project, we have to take care of those prep steps. you got to case it, trace it, transfer it, and tape it. But if you need more information than just three seconds on it, we did a video not too long ago. That'll show you how to do it. We'll put a link in the description.
So hopefully that shows you how important it is to intentionally and specifically create those low lights so that the highlights can really pop. Well, that's going to do it for this video. I will see you in the next one. In the meantime, go make something amazing.